Hey, that's good names, and welcome back to the daily advice today with a shotgun port uh, ish thing. It works kind of like a shotgun where this projectile goes, hits the wall, and then spreads out with all its contents. I filled that to the brim with a small projectile, but it doesn't always work as well as it should be. So I'll launch this one off. It is using a mix between a trebuchet and a catapult, which does work pretty nicely. It turns all the force that could be upper into horizontal force, so this would be a close sieging weapon, as I'll probably be using in the future. Yay! So I've been throwing barrels before, and they usually don't create as much damage as this. So yes, the added mass or added qualities of... Oh, that's a solid block added qualities of these little guys does influence how much force is being put through by the barrel. So yes, it does kind of work like a shotgun. Ideally, this would hit high and then just fall on who the, the contents of it would probably just fall on whoever you are attacking, but that doesn't seem to be the case, sadly. So it does work in the way that it can, but they don't really have much in the way of creating full shotgun effects with your catapults. So I'll launch the second one and see how well this one does. So once again, the kind of trebuchet looking aspect to it. This one was already beaten down by my first video. Ooh, this is interesting. It looks like the contents actually went through the broken down wall. So this would lead to more I actually don't see any contents in there. All the contents of that barrel just disappeared almost. Interesting. So there could be some glitches with this one, but this actually works kind of nicely. You can use barrels and projectiles to your advantage. And then they're just sitting out there to for you to throw back at their wall. It's an efficient pattern. Throw, throw, and more throw. And then break down their wall. So once again, thanks for watching this daily advice. As usual, there will be another one out tomorrow. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did indeed like this advice. If you do have any suggestions on advice or something you would like me to look into, please do add that in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one.